I am Amos Sedlak and these are my 10 essentials in my life. Let's get started. My first and most important essential that I can't live without is my MacBook. I bought this MacBook when I came here to the US to study at SVSU in uh, Michigan. And uh, back home I didn't use my laptop that much, but I came to the USA and uh, I realized that I need a better laptop than I used to have. It was the best decision of my life that I bought this one. I use this laptop for um, editing my uh, my videos, I uh, do my assignments here. It's a pretty fast and uh, efficient laptop. I do everything on this laptop. It's an essential piece in my life. My second essential are my sunglasses. These are Hooker's sunglasses, pretty classy. I like the color on these glasses. It's a, it's a pretty classy and simple sunglasses. It describes me and um, it's always good to have a sunglasses to keep your eyes protected, especially at summer. I think it is a good accessory to spice your outfit up sometimes. And if you are like me and you like beaches and going out in summer, then you will definitely need one of these. On to the next one, my third essential are my headphones. Now, these headphones have been with me since I was 17 years old. They are so good. Um, when I put them on, I can't even hear myself because the noise cancelling is everything, especially when you're on a plane and you travel a lot. As you guys know, I like traveling and I study in the USA while I am a citizen of Hungary. So when you guys travel, you have to have one of these because if, you're, if there's a crying baby next to you on a plane, you just put them on, turn on your music or watch a Netflix series or movie and you just can hear the noises that are next to you. You can also listen music before races and uh, get in the mentality. Noise cancelling is really good. I like the sound of it and they are pretty comfortable too. On to the next one. My fourth essential are my watches and my jewelry. This is my favorite watch and it's my only watch that I brought to the US. Uh, this is a Tissot PRX and uh, it kind of reminds me of an AP, an Audemars Piguet watch. It's pretty classy. I would pick these 10 out of 10 times over an Apple watch. I like watches because if you buy quality watches you can pass it on to your children and uh, I think that that's, uh, that's really classy and uh, stylish. Also if you buy a quality watch you can wear it for over a hundred years so i got this watch for my uh, for my 19th birthday and uh, and it kind of reminds me of my uh, successes that i achieved they are a pretty good way to um, remember something if you achieve a goal in your life you just buy a good watch and it all it will always remind you of your uh, achievements my next essentials are my beanies and my um, cap. I bought this cap recently in my Chicago trip. Um, whenever I feel lazy and uh, I have a bad hair day or something, I just use my caps and my beanies. Now the beanies, it's really cold and windy in Michigan and back home too sometimes, so it's always good to have a good beanie which is stylish and you can protect your hair in the same time you can elevate your look with uh, with beanies and uh, keep your hair healthy meanwhile i just have two beanies but i think they they look cool 
and fun so I wear them whenever I go out and it's it's gold My next design show are my colognes. These are my top two colognes, my favorite ones. I've been using this one from Armani. It's called Aqua di Gio. When I was really young, I think I was eight years old, my mom bought this uh, perfume uh, for me and uh, I've been using this ever since. It's not a strong smell, it's a summery, uh, manly smell. Uh, Pretty good one. My recent favorite is the Tom Ford Noir. It's a stronger smell. I think smelling good and um, I think smelling good and maintaining your hygiene is pretty important and uh, it's always good to have colognes. The next one are my books. I just have one physical book because I have my books on my phone because when I go to bed I always uh, read a book. This one is about Jordan and I would recommend you guys to read the book Atomic Habits, Psychology of Money. If you guys are interested in um, investing and forming good habits, these are my top two books. My next essential is, or are, my chewing gum. Now, it's another way to maintain your hygiene of your mouth. After, I don't think I have to explain these, to just pop into, you just chew, chew it for 10 minutes and your breath will smell better. So, chewing gum. It's pretty essential in my life too. My next essential is my uh, button-up shirt. Now, I always wear shirts when it's summertime, but sometimes in winter too, when it's not too, too cold. Um, I think it's pretty important to have at least five good white uh, button-up shirts because looking classy and elegant is essential for me. <clears throat> you can dress it up, you can dress it down. It's simple, you just put it on and you look good, you look elegant. Especially in the business world, if you wear a, a suit, you always need a plain white button-up shirt. Next one and uh, my final one is the is the moisturizing cream. This is a face cream. Uh, now, if you're a swimmer, your skin gets dry pretty easily because you have to jump in the water twice a day. I use face cream every day. This helps me keep my uh, skin youthful and. Uh, healthy